I don't think that kids understand that when they're taking uh, Oxycontin, Oxycodone, uh, uh, an opioid prescription medicine that's not theirs, they're exposing themselves to risk of heroin use. So we're seeing a shift in kids and adults starting to use heroin as a replacement and really um, to feed the addiction, not so much because you know, they, they want to take heroin and because they want to get the high. It's really to just help them because they, they, are, they are now addicted to an opioid. The leadership of CAPA, the Community Awareness and Prevention Association in Brecksville, Broadview Heights, Ohio, began talking about heroin use after five people died from an overdose in a nearby community. People were scared. They were worried uh, that their kids were going to be exposed, could be potentially could die. So we wanted to not only take the opportunity to educate them, but to assure them that we can make a difference by being proactive. We put that information out there uh, directly by meeting with parents. We also sent email blasts um, with information from the National Institute of Drug Abuse. Uh, we had links to videos and, and to other um, research that folks could get the information. And we also made ourselves available um, to answer any questions of our parents and our community members if they had any other concerns or what, what to do. Uh, we provided them information on how to have those talks with their kids. So talking points that they could start conversation. The coalition also began communicating with other community leaders. It's a, it's a multi-tiered approach. You, you can't just do it by working with kids, working with parents. We have to work with our governments. We have to work with our hospitals. We have to work with the recovery community. Uh, we have to you know, help people who are addicted. Heroin is an alarming drug, and there's a fine line between helping and scaring. You have to be careful how you put the information out there because you don't want to scare people. At the same time, you want to be honest. So it's all about how you wrap the information, how you present it. 